I've never seen a diamond in the flesh. That's from the Thorn episode 85, and I'm your host, McCray Mobley. And tonight's thought is actually something that happened to me today that I didn't talk about in my vlog. But I had a very rude customer. And I know, so what, McCray? You work in the retail slash grocery business, you're gonna have rude customers. Yes, but I asked this lady, did she have a or a, a, a card, one of our cards. I don't want to say where I work, so I don't want to give it away, but one of our discount cards, if you will. She says, no. So, I go, oh, well, do you have a number for it? Because some people leave it in their car, or they don't bring it, or whatever. She's like, no, I don't have one at all. I'm like, oh, okay, well, I'll just give you our courtesy card. So I use our courtesy card. And then I tell her her total, and she's like, why is it so much? And I go, well, that's because you got this brand and not the other one that's on sale. She's like, well, can I go now? I was like, yeah. Well, I don't want to do that, so just ring it up. I was like, okay. <laughs> then, uh, then she left. Now, she was very rude. And some people would say, well, what race was she? Well, that doesn't really matter. I mean, I am in the South, and some people can have attitudes if they're a certain color or not a certain color towards a certain color or whatever, because racism is real. But no, it's because this lady was from the North. She was a damn Yankee. So yes. That's what this is entitled. Damn Yankees. Because you guys know that when you come down to the South, you are rude and you think you're entitled to everything. And you like to pick on us and our Southern accents and just think we're a bunch of dumb rednecks and breads that have sex with our cousins. Well, we're not. Some of us are very intelligent. Don't take our kindness for weakness. Now, lady, if you actually watch this video and you know who I'm talking about, be nicer when you come through. Or I won't be. You guys have a great night. And I'll see you on Monday.